Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. True Gamer for Reels here for you once again. And uh, today I'm going to show you how to customize your Oculus Home. Because if you ask me, a lot of those home screens are just a little boring and not as cool as you want them to be. But this is going to fix all that. So, first thing you need to do is have side quest, And uh, the other thing you need to do is have Discord. So, what you want to do is go over to the Discord link in the description and uh, this is going to be quest homes and once you're in the actual discord you want to go down to quest home environments here and then uh, in the top right you can search for pretty much anything you want so uh, if you want something from the matrix you can just type in the matrix and then uh, right here on the right hand side you're going to see different themes and things like that that you can download and then all you want to do is just click on the download uh, link and pretty much download all those files. Now you'll see that they are broken down into Classic Home, Classic Home Silent, Cyber City, Cyber City Highland, or Silent, and so on and so forth. Uh, the Silent means they're absolutely silent and have no sound in them at all, obviously. The other ones are just your regular ones. So what you want to do is these are going to actually replace the APK, APK files that are on your quest as it is. So, um, if you replace the matrix classic home, you're going to be clicking on classic home and that classic home will no longer be there. It'll be your matrix one. So just keep in mind of all of that going on right there. So once you have all those downloaded uh, or you found the one you want with the discord, you want to go ahead and open up side quest. So once side quest is open, uh, you want to click up here in the top right. And that is going to say currently installed apps. Um, then you pretty much want to scroll down and try to find um, your APKs for the environment. Now, if they don't show, make sure you just click show all, and then we can try to uh, find them here for you. Uh, let's see. Okay, so there's the one environment. So let's see what else we can find. And basically, you're just looking for the one you're replacing, and you want to uninstall it. So hopefully, where, where is this at? Okay, uh, here's one for you right here. The Oculus Environment Winter Lodge. Now, what I'm going to do in order to make sure that we can restore that if we ever wanted the factory one back, you want to go over here to the right on the cog and click that, and you want to back up APK file. All right, once that's backed up, it'll say all tasks completed down here in the left. And then you can actually double verify by clicking on the cog again. And it's going to show your file is backed up there. So that way, if you ever screw it up, you can restore that APK file and get the original Winter Lodge back. So um, next, basically what you want to do is just go ahead and click the cog and uninstall app. All right, once it does that, it'll show all tasks are completed and your winter lodge will no longer be there. All right, next thing you want to do is install that. So in the very top right hand corner, you want to go install APK file from folder on computer. And then you want to find that APK folder or APK uh, that you downloaded. So I've got all mine on my desktop. And for this one, I'm going to be doing a chrono trigger one uh, for the winter lodge. So just double click that. And down at the bottom, we'll say all tasks completed. All right, next step, you want to go ahead and throw on your quest, and we'll show you that winter environment. Okay, so now that we are in the quest here, you just want to go ahead and hit your right Oculus button. Go ahead and go over to your settings. And then you want to click on virtual environment. Now, make sure that you select the one that you actually installed this one in my case would be the winter lodge it will not show your actual environment here on the tiles but just make sure you click the one you installed as you can see each one is going to be different most of them are winter lodge or classic or space station or cyber city all depending on which one you do so this one i installed the chrono winter lodge so i'll go ahead and hit apply on that And bada bing, bada boom. I got a little chrono trigger scene going on right here. You got the music from the fairground. And I think that's really freaking neat. So 
yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, super simple and easy to do. And yeah, I'll go ahead and show you guys some other ones that I um, came up with or found. And I, I thought it was actually really freaking neat and cool. So yeah, let's check them out real quick. All right, so let's move on to the other ones we got here. So this was the Chrono Trigger one. And I have that under my Winter Lodge. Uh, the next one is my classic home, which is the freaking Matrix. How dope is that? I mean, you can't get any better than that. Look at that. That's just crazy. We got the black cat over there that you've seen twice in the movie. That's really freaking cool. And uh, up next, we got the Cyber City I changed. Look at that. Peach's Castle. We even got the guy flying around. I mean, that's that's just freaking the coolest ever, if you ask me. And that's from the Mario 64 version. And last but not least, what you guys might have been waiting for was uh, the space station, which is uh, the Simpsons. Yeah, itchy and scratchy on here. Sitting right in the Simpsons living room. So, yeah, how freaking cool, guys. So, yeah, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and uh, have a great night. Thank you